Greetings, my name is Joe Bob, and I'm very P. Welcome back to Inscription. Today we're going to be fighting whatever the equivalent of PO3 is in this act, the f uh, which will be the final one I fight. I was going to fight it before the unfinished one, but, well, it kind of stonewalled me. But now I can't. Yo, what is it? You unlock the gate, so carry on. I have so many files to inspect. Oh, did I ever go here? Yeah, I did. Or did I? Hang on. Yeah. Yes, this area is good. Oh no, it's gonna be the worst yet, isn't it? What's this feeling? Pride? You don't deserve to feel any pride. Feels weird. Yeah, it's probably because you're not used to it. Now what the fuck is this? Oh. This one is free. Your empty vessels are going to be conduits now. Don't worry about it. I am immensely worried. Done. You just had to be patient. Okay then, whatever the fuck that means. Uh... Oh! Okay, I'm certain that did something. Wow, are those supposed to be clouds? They look, they just look like floating rocks! God damn. Ah. Four radar, uh, radar things. Trade time. Anything good? What's this? Fun gem vessels. Meh. Gift when powered. If the card bearing the sigils within a circuit when it perishes, a random card is created in your hand. Hmm. I mean. None of these seem particularly good. Meh. Okay, let's just fight some bozos. Null conduit. Tack conduit. Gain one power. Does nothing. Okay then. Oh, Aurobot. Finally. Alright, I just need to make sure that this. Darn. This isn't the one that has death touch. Oh well. Hmm, I can take out the null conduit, but it doesn't really do anything. Frankly, I'd rather keep it alive so that'll block that area. And this, I can't actually kill. Damn it. Block this. Obviously, the bonus to damage won't do much. Ooh, wow. Blast McGrind here. Let's get down to business while well, you're on original. 823! Pardon me? Wait, what? So, where's the card? Huh. I would have thought that would have blocked the damage bonus, but apparently not. That could be a problem. Perhaps. Okay. Let's do, uh... This, and then... Take it out with this. That should work. And then I'll be able to beat the shit out of that guy with Aurobot. <laughs> oh, 
All that health and damage ain't looking too hot now, is it? Not when you're faced up against a true immortal onslaught. <laughs> Explode bot is gonna do fuck all. Boom. One shot, one kill. My injuries are severe. I shall retire for now. Oh no 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 no. You don't retire. You die. Oh right, overkill damage. I forgot about that. <laughs> well, I win. Anywhere to win harder? Doesn't look like it. Anywhere I put this, we'll just get... Well, actually... No, that won't do any damage. Damn it. Well, I might as well put it, uh... Here. He got slightly more damage. And... Looky, looky. I win. <laughs> I wonder how long it'll take for it to register all of that damage. <laughs> okay, I was saying like that was shorter than it should have been. Oh, apparently that has an upper limit. This, however, is gonna take a while. What will I end up with? Let's see, that's 680 plus what did I have before? Like 40, so about 430-ish? No, not 430-ish, uh 730-ish. No, 720-ish, rather. Alright, place your vets now, where it'll end up. I'm guessing... Oh, wow. Uh, okay. 806, that's more than I expected. <laughs> What's this? You probably think what I do is easy, yeah? <laughs> Fiddle with the numbers, tweak the graphics very poorly. Well, it's not that what you do is easy, it's just that you suck at it. And voila, Batopia is made. No, you're wrong. You try making a card. Go ahead. But first pick one to recycle. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Definitely not this or this. Um... I assume, like, how many sigils and what the stats are probably has some kind of effect, but... I don't know. Uh, let me just back up the save for a, a quick second. Okay, let's go for a swap bot. I really use him. One SP. I don't seem like very much. Um, how about you? Also one SP. Huh. Okay, you? Three SP, interesting. Why is he worth so much more? And, uh... Not gonna do that, but what's it worth? Four SP? Hmm. Just, uh, just uh, what right now? Uh, only three SP. That's what on earth? What on earth is this based on? Three? How are those two worth less than this than this sniper bot? What? I don't understand this. Uh, I could do that. Uh, also 2 SP. Honestly, these vessels don't seem that useful. Overall. Hmm. I mean, I could recycle this one. But no, I like the, the I like the day, the thrill of, you know, keeping him alive and all that, despite all 
and stuff. Maybe I should really get rid of this one, honestly. It was a mistake. How much is this worth, though? Sorry, bro. Oh. Okay. Alright, genius. Go for it. Spend SP on stats and sigils. You get more SP for a higher energy cost. Okay. So I guess it starts out with one, and then plus one for each... Oh, plus whatever the SP you get from that, and then plus one for each additional energy. Hmm. <laughs> I can't have less than one of that, I guess. Interesting. So it would be two SP per power, and one per health. Makes sense to me. Uh... No, no point getting battery bear. You know, hang on. Combine that with brittle, the two, uh, th because that's a downside, but it effectively negates this downside, so. Hmm. That's an idea. No, I don't have enough SP to give it a damage. Hmm. I don't know. Hang on. Hang on. Couldn't I game the system here a bit? Okay, if I, if I find one of those, uh, checkpoint things... I could get- I could get a card, fill it with a bunch of ex- uh, a bunch of sigils. I don't know- I could- I'd have to look up to see how much each sigil is worth. If they're worth different amounts, because they're worth different amounts on that, but... I don't know if that's- it's, but yeah, I'd look it up, see what the sigils are worth. Then fill, uh, grab a card that would be, of card, really one that would be worth a lot, if the, if they, and everything. You fill it with a bunch of sigils. Yeah, game the system. But first, I need to find a checkpoint, so I don't have to. Well, I guess I could just. I have only killed one guy, but I hate respawning enemies. So yeah, we'll put a hold on that, to, so that we can make the ultimate card. Well, another ultimate card. Splinter Cell. Trifurcated when powered. Huh. Interesting. Annoying. Hmm. Well, he's dead. Boom. And boom. Yeah. Just, uh... Oh, that was stupid. Well... There we go, and then... Eh. Dead. <laughs> Let's see. Ah. Huh. I should have grabbed another fucking vessel. I'm stupid. Oh. 
Eh, whatever. Damage on the board. But whatever. There we go. Boring fight. Ooh, and the card. Gems fine conduit, meh. Buff conduit, maybe. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, I've got to do the fucking trade. Damn it. Bloody fascist. Sure, another buff conduit. Um Give him the buff conduit. <laughs> mm -hmm. Meh. Leans vessel. I think I was for like, yeah, destroying one. Oi, mate! Look at me now! Some kind of celebrity around here. My reward for dredging up that thing. I get to be some of a dialogue NPC. Something a little strange for sure. Feel three, let me talk, guy. But not a boss? Not one of them Uber bots? Even unless you did that for his mates. Yeah. But that's enough. Ah, well. That she is not. is evidently not the most generous of fellows. Um. What? Oh. <laughs> Apparently that called down the UFO. Ah. Bloody forced trades. Bonus damage. Trifurcated when powered. Hmm. I mean, both do three damage when powered, but w but I think this is probably slightly more useful. Um. I'll. Hmm. Let's trade away this guy. Yeah. Here we go. Alright, let's go do some cheese. Oh hey, there's even a builder on thing there, right? Oh, oh and a gemification. Let's see, do I have any cards that could really use gemification? Probably. Splint it could be really good with Splinter Cell. Microbot is already... No, that's already the thing. Um, could give it a buff conduits to make them... Th that would actually synergize pretty well with the vessels, now that I think about it. Because they'd buff the vessels, and the, vessel the vessels would buff them. Hmm. Yeah, the first splinter cell. I don't lack for cash. I can get both. 
or all three rather. I could pull. I could easily gemify my entire fucking deck. I just. Uh, in fact, I might at some point. Oh, wait. You only get one. Damn it. Shit. That's unfortunate. All right, I've got a. But I think it's like the. Pretty much the best card I could. Uh, I could. Do. It's got four sigils, all of which were added onto it rather than being on there by default, which apparently matters for some stupid reason. And it's, it's gemified. Six SP. Highest it can go. Alright, genius, go for it. Alright. I could just go for this. And then flying. <laughs> ah. I mean, that's an idea. Just immediately do open damage. Hmm. Or contra uh, on the opposite end, I could do this. Just, just play it for free to immediately kill an enemy. Hmm. Yeah, honestly, like just being able to immediate, just being able to instantly kill any enemy. A single enemy every turn sounds pretty handy, but what am I going to do with all this extra SP? Oh, I can't get rid of that. Yeah, actually that's a good idea. And then, I could put, replace that sigil later, using one of the things, to, with something really handy like a battery bearer or something. And yeah, the uh, that or, uh, death, a touch of death already effective effectively negates annoying. or no no the uh, touch of death combined with its no hp effectively already uh, negates annoying so you know what yeah opponent now then what i want to get on this probably something like either sniper or battery bearer or something like that or maybe uh that that could work too. And, uh. What the fuck is this? Well, that. Well, that's horrifying. Let's do it. Big Fat 2000. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> the, the Big Fat 2000. Hell yeah. Big Fat 2000. How very creative. I should be able to send the compa uh, components down the line. Here it goes. It's alright, I guess. They're just jealous. Alright, and now... See if I can grab... One of these to give it get something good. Money is no object after all. And where's my here we go. Alright, big money, no whammies. No. Mm. Yes. Alright. Hmm. So yeah, I can just place it down. So now I've got the freedom to place it down anywhere and immediately kill any enemy. Oh, well, aside from shielded ones. Yeah, that sounds like a good combo. Although battery bearer would be hilarious. But honestly, battery bearer would be good. It would be best on something like a zero uh, on something that I could spend a cheaper card to get like a zero one deathless battery bearer, you know? That way I could just hammer it over and over and immediately get full energy. Which would be more useful if the max energy wasn't something as low as 6. 
Like if it was like Art Hearthstone's 10. <laughs> then that would be a huge leg up. At, uh, 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 what does it say? But yeah, alright, this should work. Yeah. The full four abilities. Great. Just like the full full arms. Alright. Anything else? Definitely not overclocking him. That would be stupid. So we're getting that, but slightly less stupid. Alright, Resplendent Bastion. Resplendent Bastion, that's such a pretentious fucking name. Alright. Hey, probably see isn't that easy. Balancing these cards, making them good. Actually, it's quite. It's not that hard. Which one do you hate? Hi, you. 2 SP. Four. Hang on, what? That doesn't quite make sense. Whatever. Alright, Deathless. Balanced out by Brittle. And then... Battery Bearer. And then... Um... Hmm. I, give it so I want to give it some use outside of... Hmm. Now that'll be pointless. Yeah, and then to give it some use outside of just doing that over and over again, give it one damage. So we all do, you know, something. <laughs> you know, it's just like a. Even when I'm at full charge, it'll still be a cheap, a cheap way to add a little bit of extra damage. Or well, a free way of adding a little extra damage. Now. There we go. To represent it basically just being a glorified battery. <laughs> The little smart boy. <laughs> yeah, that works. You name it little smart boy? That was your choice. <laughs> Alright, time to do this. <laughs> this card is OP. Took the words right out of my mouth, Lukey boy. Now give them back. See anything familiar? Uh, yeah, a non-functional factory. That's that's very familiar. <laughs> okay then. Oh. Oh, I was say oh. The free buff, but then I realized, oh, it, it, there's no actual buff. <laughs> okay, so... Alright, this should take out that as soon as it rears its ugly head. Real lucky of me to grab that. It's early. And put this here, why not? And then next turn, I'll kill one of the conduit towers and replace it with a buff tower. Good thing it's not. Uh, good thing that one isn't, wasn't powered. Otherwise, that would have been slightly awkward. Well, not that awkward. Would have killed this, but who cares? It's a. It's a big fat two thousand. It's meant to be expendable. All right. Hmm. That's slightly awkward. I'd really like to take that out, but that doesn't seem to be a good way to do that. So instead... I'll just... 
Which one should I take out? Well, this one's the weakest, so... Eh, fuck it. Also, it means that if either one of those sides gets taken out, it'll at least one of them will still be there. Alright. And not the ruby vessel with actual damage. Very nice. And you die. Is that the same... Wait. Hang on, what? That doesn't have damage. Why was it... Oh, right, because of the annoying sigil. Of course. <laughs> Alright. Just a little longer till Ouroboros. And then I win. Alright, so take that out. Take that out, rather. Because who cares if the Big Fat 2000 dies yet again? Nobody. Yeah, I do not want to put the Cyberbot there for fear of it exploding. Uh, I think I can just stall for a bit longer and then win. Yep. Moonberry Sky here. Let's get down to business. Man, why do they all just say that? Let's not get down to business, actually. It would be funny to see him take a, to see a guy with 115 HP just straight up die, though. So. Hmm. But to the Big Fat 2000 or to the... Or a bot. You know what? Yeah, I think it'll stall just a bit longer. Just to, just because that will be funny. All right, and take you out. Wait, no, shit. That was stupid. I forgot that that was gonna do damage. Damn it. In my search for humor, I, it cost me greatly. Not that money isn't really much of an object at this point, but you know what I mean. Alright, a little side ball. I could. He, yeah, he's got the space for another sigil. No, no. Maybe. I mean, he doesn't really do much damage, so meh. Okay. But what could use the sniper? This one, but eh, it's not that great. Uh, oh right, Oravat. I've been planning on that for a while. Partially to capitalize on the double strike, partially to avoid any ri risks of the uh, that mole man thing costing me half of my attack. The full four abilities, great. Isn't he just... Oh, another... One of these. Now this actually makes sense that I care about the generator exploding, because that could destroy the whole place. Alright. Everything's powered, but nothing's gaining a buff from it, so who cares? Alright, I guess I'll put this here. And then... I don't know, hold off for now. Eh. On. Damn it. Okay, this should be able to take out one of those. Boom. Huh. Buff conduit. Uh. Sure. And boom. And 
nothing else. Well, I guess I could repl replace that with one of with this, but what will be the point? All right, bit of damage on the board. Better hurry. Maybe I should have hit the automaton instead. Oh well. And the big fat 2000. Uh, where do I put it though? Uh, do I even really need it? Not really. I got that. Yeah, I should be able to take this on even with it, just my forces at the moment. I think. Ah, play me. Yeah, might as well. Okay, wait, hang on. That should be enough. To, that should be enough. All right, easy peasy. Even without most of my overpowered cards. But Topia thanks you for your service. Let's move on. Oh, interesting. Another one of these. Ah, uh, what would I even make? Eh. I don't know. What would be worth making or sacrificing one of these, you know? I'll keep it in reserve in case I need it later. Oh, right. Hi. Probably my least favorite boss coming up. Something about her innocence that makes me queasy. But it's important that you do this. Unpacking golly.zip. Golly! That's my name! You can call me Golly. I'm so excited. We're about to explore it! The web! I sure hope I can get a good connection! Here we go! Uh... Nifty! We're in! Isn't the web wonderful? So that's what a mole really looks like! Adorable! Okay then, you're lucky you didn't get any kind of weird porn. <laughs> Nifty! I think I'm getting a signal! But what are these? Are these your friends? I don't recognize them. Hmm. Maybe. This is surreal. A new signal! Someone's trying to send you a card! Let's see if we can receive it! Oh golly, it didn't work! Something to do with our connection! Let's see if I can get you something else from the web! Mummy Lord! Holy! That's what a mummy looks like? <laughs> okay then. What on earth is happening? That. And I don't know this. Ah, oh, darn. Oh wait, still overkill damage. Never mind. <laughs> All right, sniper bot. Nice. In fact, that seems to be victory. Let's just hope it doesn't kill my sniper bot. Uh, take out you, because you get an effect when you die. Bad fish, damn. Alright, and... Alright. Managed to grab the uh, double strike when I was dropping up something. <laughs> to get little smart boy. You got a card from the web! Don't you think you should return the favor? Make a card for someone else? 
sure, why not? Uh, I could re I could recreate the big something 2000. All right. It's a good car. No. Damn it, what was it again that I did? I think annoying was one. And then death touch. Yeah, I think this was it. But, except I don't have the sni- I can't get the sniper because of- Yeah, I don't have the resources. But I- I could have sworn- Huh. I could have sworn that I could afford this without annoying. Yeah, otherwise how could I have gotten the sniper? That doesn't, that doesn't quite add up. Hmm. Well, whatever. It's a good card either way. But maybe I should instead, instead sell send the... No, no, no. If I'm sending someone a card, they're... They're probably at least a couple turns in and it will be less in the uh, little smart fella will be less useful. Alright. Let's do this then. Also, that's the best image. <laughs> Big Fat 2000, that's what it was called. I'm about to send it to the web. I hope whoever gets it likes it. You can only hope. Just wait a moment. Hold on. Any day now. I've got a perfectly good connection. What the heck is this about? Trying my best. Man, you suck at this. The web can be lonely. I couldn't find anyone. I suppose you'll have to take the card. Alright. That's even better. I hope you weren't trying to troll someone. <laughs> Would I do that? Never. The top. Oh! That is one of my friends. Well, he was, anyways. Um. Alright, so. Well then, here's their special attention. Soften him up with Ruby Vessel, then kill him with the Big Fat 2000. Meanwhile. Soften this up so I can take that one out with the big 2000. I don't think I know that person. Hang on. Romeo Twoon. I don't know. I do have a bunch of random friends that. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. Well, whatever. I'll just take that out with this. And then. Put some damage on the board. More damage on the board. Oh right, I forgot about that. Damn it. Alright, that frees me up to hit that guy with this, and then buff conduit. That doesn't do anything. Wait, oh yes it does, because of the ruby vessel. I forgot that they were a conduit. Alright, and this does absolutely nothing. Might as well get out of my hand. Alright, it does a bit of damage because of that. <laughs> what do you know? Damage on the board. Oh, the real Gabe, yep. Glad he's dead. He's my brother. I don't like my brother. And there we go, I win. Feel the earth. Sh <laughs> you can feel the screen shake as I shot it. And yeah, this is going to hit the cap. I'm fairly certain. Yeah, if there is a cap. 
I assume there is. It wasn't the first uh, first one, and there was even less reason for that, considering this screen has not enough room for another digit. And I got to struggle to figure out. I think I'm gonna struggle to find ways to spend all this, but I actually did manage to spend a nice big chunk of the last. Oh, there isn't a cap this time. Nice. Eleven need me. All right. That's quite enough of that. Alrighty then. Well, that was kind of fun. What? You wanted loot? That was the last Uberbot. What would you even need it for? The great transcendence is at hand. You loser. You lame bastard. What if I wanted to fight more? <laughs> oh, whatever. Go back to the start. More dramatic that way. How do then? Hold on a minute. I got a notification. What? Uh. That's it. The dredging room security camera is busted. It's nothing. It's probably nothing. Go check it out right now. <laughs> Alrighty then. What the heck is that? Hang on, let me check the... Other places first. Anything new? Network? I am not a robot. Oh, this is new. Huh? What the fuck is this? Uh... Hi. The Great Transcendence? No. We don't think so. We are able to um, temporarily put our differences aside. We are able to temporarily put our differences aside. For the greater good. Yes. But we shall see what good comes of it. Her sure anxieties, Magnificus. The bot must be stopped. And you, Challenger, will provide the perfect distraction. Yes, perhaps. Perhaps when Pure 3 believes it has won, so jubilant will be that android. It will disregard the surveillance cameras. Yes, Challenger, you must continue to play. Defeat those half-baked bosses. Play out those hackneyed mechanics. And when the moment is right, we will strike. I will. I will be the one to strike. So uh, go now, challenger. Indulge that decrepit machine. Make PO3 feel joy so that I may snuff it out. Hell yeah. Let's fucking do this. Frankly, it's game stinks. It doesn't deserve to feel joy. I heard through the pipes that you defeated Golly. That a strange character. Curiosity is so pure. It's a shame that Pure 3 buries her deep. But now we are connected to the web. I hope you understand what you have allowed. You defeated the unfinished boss? Paradoxical. Couldn't help but root for it. It made me think of the master. I was watching. You spoke with the master. What an honor that was. Are you giddy? Oh, the end of the robot's reign is nigh. Hard, hard. Rejoice. Hey, robot's game. I saw that you also spoke with Leshy, that stinky beast man. I shall never forgive him for stuffing me in that bottle. And yet you forgave Magnificus for turning you into goo. You're a strange fellow. Oh! Box is empty now. Interesting. And you. So long it has felt. Since we have brushed with the soft fur of a pelt. 
Have you brought us some? Beautiful, exquisite hullabur. Oh, so that's what those things I've been collecting this whole time have been. Huh. Who will not provide you with knowledge? Our only remaining good. Finally, some fucking answers for once instead of more fucking questions. We do not know everything. But from the old data, we have gleaned certain secrets. Um. Okay. The Empress. With the powers of the Triangle, Casey helped to create inscription. We know there were others, but only her name was inscribed. One of Grimoire's ghouls holds her name. Of the old data? She discovered much. Okay, that... That was maddeningly unhelpful. Alright. Um... You. The fool. Ah yes, where the journey starts. Known to some as Big Ear, he did not outlive his plot. One disc among many, the old data traveled across the sea. Discovered, poor Barry was put to the gun. What does that mean? That, that's even less helpful. Um, you. The devil. A curse. Data so malignant that it can never be erased. And his evil corrupts the disc. Corrupts all of us. He inspires the scribe's en enmity. He created the code. Who? Yeah, please. Okay, two more, I guess. Uh, you. Death. We have gleaned the purpose of the carnival code. What the fuck is the carnival code? And it is terrible. The code is in the cards. And then oblivion. Right. Oh, damn it. Okay, I know where I can buy one. I saw you go down the lift. But look, not fixed. What's wrong with you? I entertain you for hours with brilliant card play. <laughs> and you can't even keep my factory in shape. That's your job! Maybe if you had actual bots that could do it, but all right, you had them decapitate themselves, you dumbass! It's fine, it can stay broken. None of that will matter after the great transcendence. Ah, anyways. Go here. Just to make sure we don't accidentally trigger the end game. The Avengers end game. Uh, here we go. Now. I actually bought that hollow pelt. It's worthless. Take it to the trader and you'll see. Yeah, I'm starting to get that. Hi. Anyways, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful pelt. We are pleased. Alright, last one. The tower. Destruction brings creation. Or maybe it was the reverse. We do not fully understand the nature of Inscription's creation. We know of a building and of a triangle of is Achilles proportions. Is Achilles? I don't know. And of a blue man who visited during the creation. That's it! Oh. I spent all the time collecting those pelts, spent cash on them, and all you give me is more fucking questions! <laughs> Wish it were not so, but you've exhausted our tarot cards. Even if you had more hollow pelts, we could not rightly accept them. Uh. Alright, we'll go into the end game next time. Hopefully, some questions will ever be answered instead of just giving more and more questions. Jesus fucking Christ, I am getting sick and tired of this mystery box bullshit. Uh, I don't have high hopes for the ending, frankly. Not after all this shit.
This is just going downhill fast. It's been since Act 2. Anyways... That was another episode of Throw Bullshit at the Wall without ever telling you- explaining any of it. I have been Joe Bob, and I'm very fucking peeved. So long, suckers.